you're listening or watching another episode of Fabulous Investments, a documentary filming my road to success in real estate. I'm your host, Jimmy L, and this is my journey. Don't forget to hit the like button and leave a comment. Hello, 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 hello. Um, I know it's been maybe about a week now, so um, there's probably a lot that I need to catch up on. <laughs> so this video here, however, will not explain everything in detail. I just wanted to give you guys a really, really quick video, let you know that I'm still pushing forward. I'm still working on some things and, you know, hopefully very soon things will actually work out in my favor. Hopefully so. Um, I will say that I put my first contract um, out. Well, I shouldn't say first contract out. I sound like I'm a hitman or something. But but I put my first contract. I've written my first contract. So um, we're going to, I guess, roll with it. So I've done a lot of things wrong along the way. I've done, obviously, a lot of things right. But um, I'm going to share as much as I possibly can with you guys as soon as possible. So I'm wanting to go ahead and get this deal underway, completely locked down, and I'm wanting to close on it. And then I'll come back and I'll give you guys the full details as to exactly what happened, um, what's my outlook on it, what's my um, my end game with it, um, near and, and far, so that you guys at least know where I'm coming from and again where I'm going. So you guys look forward to that. So again, I do apologize for this quick, quick video, but you know, hey, it is what it is. So I will say this, if you're out there and you're starting your first deal or your first couple of deals, um, something that I've just learned from my coworker who attended the doggone last MIG meeting that I didn't get a chance to make and I didn't get a chance to make it because we went up to see my in-laws who are awesome by the way, but um, went up to see my in-laws in Illinois and I'm so glad we did. We got a chance to get away from our hometown and well, my hometown anyway, <laughs> we got a chance to get away and just kind of get away from work and just kind of relax and you know. You know, kind of had a ball and just spent time with the family. But because of that, I missed the MIG meeting this month. So that means now I have to wait until April because, of course, the MIG meetings only happen once a month. Um, the guy that spoke at this MIG meeting was, I, I read his bio, um, and the man is awesome. And I so hate that I missed it. But, however, needless to say, I did. And, and you know, it's just one of those things that happened but I missed it and I'll fill you guys in on as much as I can that I can go back and watch the videos on and <laughs> and fill, fill you in with a little more information and hopefully encourage myself as well as broaden my horizon but um, back to what I was saying the one thing that I learned from my co-worker is when you're making an offer never ever make an offer using solid digits example um, if you're going to make an offer for $55,000, never offer $55,000 even. Offer something like $54,500 or $53,397. When you do something like that and you add those additional two numbers onto the end of your, your asking price, it gives the assumption that you know what you're talking about. You've done your numbers and you have this science down to the T. And so, you know, uh, it, it gives an impression. I hate to say that on this deal, I did not follow those instructions because I missed the MIG meeting. But, <laughs> um, but anyway, I guarantee you on the next one, I will definitely be following that. So um, good luck with you guys. If you're out there trying something, um, you can shoot me an email. Be sure to leave a like. Um, on here be sure to leave a comment if there's anything that you guys are wanting to know just be sure to let me know and i'll be sure to answer them as much as i can but for the time being again i apologize for the quick quick video i will fill you guys in on the exact deal i'll fill you guys in on the numbers i'll fill you all in on the exact process that i've done um, to get to where i am now and where i hopefully um, i'll be within the next week or two so hey um look forward to that you guys and make sure you stay tuned with me and I um, guess that's it. <laughs> See you guys on the next episode of Fabulous Investments. Love you.